up, you fucking haters? Guess what we're talking about today? Galaxy's Edge. You know what? Galaxy's Edge is fantastic, baby. I'd love to go to Galaxy's Edge. You know how much I'd pay to go to Galaxy's Edge? I'd tell you right now, a ton. How about 500 bucks? 1,000 bucks? I don't know, baby. Looks exceptional to me. All these haters gotta say, oh, gotta stay away from Galaxy's Edge. Oh, no one's Galaxy's Edge. Give it some time, motherfucker. The thing's gonna fill up. Look at those kyber crystals they're selling. Look at those sporks they got. It's a miracle, brother. Here we go. Let's get into this article about how Galaxy's Edge is empty, and it's only been empty for just a little, little while. Let me not forget. Big shout out to Brie Lawson. You go, girl. We'll see you soon. Why are Star Wars Galaxy's Edge and Disneyland not busy on opening weekend? That's a fucking mystery to me. Disney opens the most amazing, fan-fucking-tastic theme park in the world. And haters don't go. It's trolls. It's Russian bots. What do you guys think it is? You guys think sexists are going to go to Galaxy's Edge? Guess again, baby. They're home. They're in their basement. They're doing things you don't want to know about. Disney messed up the reservation schedule. Come on. Extensive blackouts for days. There was power problems. It's in Florida, baby. Disney had problems with the parking garage. That makes perfect sense, baby. Come on here. I'm saying come on a lot. I'm saying baby lot because I got to defend Galaxy's Edge from the trolls, from the haters, from the people like John Paul Rye, who you know are at home. <laughs> Trolling. Disney set a very fair price of $99 for a pass to get in the park. Who doesn't have 99 bucks to see Galaxy's Edge, get some sporks, see Mickey, maybe even a little surprise appearance from a stormtrooper or Kylo Ren while you're over there. <laughs> you know what else this article says? It says, geniusly, that there's a Harry Potter theme park that's doing really well. So, people, when they're done with Harry Potter, are going to, of course, go to Star Wars. Harry Potter's always been holding back Star Wars, baby. Come on. And trolls say, we shills don't have good excuses. I think my excuses are worth a million bucks. And if I could sell each one, just one, I'd be rich, baby. But I'm already rich. I'm rich in heart and soul. And most importantly, honest energy for you guys here at Entertainment Hacker. You don't fucking follow me because you think I'm funny, because you think I'm a shill. You fucking follow me because you want to help save entertainment from the troll man baby mangelistic freaks that are out there on the internet. And I'm a white knight, and I'm the whitest white knight, baby. I will see you next time because I have to. Fuck you, John Paul Rye. <laughs>